My name is Reverend Jordan Harris. I am the pastor of Connection. So the story behind Connection is we are um, what I like to call a reimagined United Methodist faith community. Uh, Connection is a congregation born out of another congregation back over in Davis Square. There's a church that was once known as College Ave United Methodist Church. It was a staple faith community of the city of Somerville. It was around for, a, you know, 125 plus years. About seven years ago, they closed their doors and um, bought and renovated this space known as Connection. So Connection is incredibly diverse and diverse with like a capital D, right? It's as diverse as I, I feel like we can really get. And we have folks from all walks of life, you know, both racial and ethnic diversity, but then also um, lots of folks in the LGBTQIA community. We have folks who, you know, are both living in homelessness as well as folks who are retired Harvard professors. You know, we have folks that just run the gambit of, of diversity that come together to, to worship here together and share their stories with one another. So what led me to become a pastor was actually an experience of homelessness of my own. When I was about 12 years old, me and my family were living in our car. My mother, my brother, my sister and I, and we were staying at a campground pretending that we were camping. And there was a group that was coming by that was inviting kids to a, a Bible study. And granted, I didn't know what a Bible study was, but they said they also had games and free food. And a 12 year old absolutely knows what those things are. And so me and my siblings went and that was the first place that they really kind of introduced Christianity as a whole to us. I'll also name, this was, you know, the, the time in which Harry Potter was just coming out and uh, stories like Alice in Wonderland just really captivated me and so I started getting introduced to Christianity and, and the Bible but then also Harry Potter and all of it blended in my, my mind as this just highly imaginative way to, to survive. So my story around how I ended up here in this wonderful opportunity was I came to Boston University School of Theology a couple of years ago for my Master's in Divinity. I was serving at a, a church in the south end of Boston and then the, the pastor who was at Connection before me decided to step down. I love just the opportunity to, to wake up each day not knowing what's going to happen but knowing that ultimately we as Connection, we as Somerville, will uh, we have the tools and the resources to, to rally to, to face anything that this day brings us. So as an openly gay person of faith, as an openly gay pastor, I think one of the, the greatest things that I am learning is that ultimately I belong here. Um, I think when you have to fight for uh, your opportunity to show love, when you have to fight for your place um, anywhere, you deeply begin to, to learn, you know, other folks' struggles, you learn a lot about empathy and just the ways in which um, oppression is very, very real. And we're a space that works hard to value those stories that, you know, we, we say every week we're a safe and sacred community. We want you here, we're glad you're here, and we're going to do anything we can to, to help you be present in this moment. Likewise, Monday through Saturday, Folks don't even know we're a church half the time. Um, Connection is just this open uh, community center that just really helps to, to embody, you know, our, our namesake that, you know, we value the, the intersectionality that exists within this community and within individuals in this community. My name is Reverend Jordan Harris and I'd love for you to stop on by here at Connection. Look us up on Facebook or visit our website at connectionumc.org. You are welcome here.